Hey Mick, I guess on one hand, nice to be comfortably into Q2, but was there a little bit of part of you that thought Q3 might have been possible? Uh, Q3 was definitely possible, uh, possible today. Uh, I'm a bit gutted that I didn't get there. Um, yeah, the good thing is we know we have the potential, and uh, now it's just a matter of uh, putting it together in the next 22 uh, races to come. Was it a case of just not hooking up the perfect lap to get traffic? What, what happened? Yeah, no, I think it was, uh, it was a combination of things. I just didn't feel the groove, I guess, uh, tonight. Um, but hopefully it will be better tomorrow. And uh, again, we have two, 22 more races coming our way. I'm sure we'll, uh, we'll be in the position to do that soon. Given the pace that you guys have shown so far this weekend, points the target tomorrow? I think so. Uh, it is realistic and we have the car to do that. Now it's just a matter of putting all the bits and pieces together and uh, be in the points. Esteban, all right. so, so close to making it through, less than a tenth, what went wrong? Yeah, it's, it's, been, uh, it's been very close and we knew that it was going to be, uh, you know, all, all tight, um, you know, to get into Q3, but I'm um, pretty happy with, uh, with the step that we've made into qualifying. You know, we were lacking a little bit of pace on, on my side of the garage since the beginning of the weekend. Um, but uh, yeah, clearly we, uh, we stepped up in that quali and you know, losing out for, for you know, less than a tenth into Q3 is not a bad thing. And uh, the positive for tomorrow is that we still have new tyres. And the data that I saw, let, saw look, made it look like your race pace looked pretty good. Does that give you confidence that tomorrow could be a, a positive afternoon? Yeah, definitely. I mean, that's what we want to achieve, of course. Um, you know, we want to be scoring points from, from the first race. A lot is going to happen, uh, as always, in the first Grand Prix. So, yeah, looking forward.